Hey everybody, this is Mark at Safe Day Trading Podcast and I welcome you. Thank you for listening to our podcast and for your desire to discover how to safely trade the market to master the art of day trading. For a limited time only, sign up for our free Safe Day mini course, free ebook, and free live trading session. Go to our website and register today at safedaypodcast.com. Again, that is safedaypodcast.com. All presenters and guests of Safe Day Trading Podcast opinions are their own and do not constitute financial advice in any way whatsoever. Nothing produced by Safe Day Trading Podcast constitutes a investment recommendation, nor should any data or content produced by Safe Day Trading Podcast be relied upon for investment activity. Safe Day Trading Podcast recommends that you perform your own independent research before making any financial decisions. Hey everybody, today is August 22nd, 2023. I hope you're all doing well. It is hot here. Tomorrow it's going to be 104 in the upper Midwest. It's going to be like cooking eggs on the asphalt. It's going to be hot. So anyway, let's talk about what's going on. I've got some interesting uh, rumors coming through that uh, you may want to be, at least have a heads up on. Uh, First of all, let's look at oil. Oil is below 80. It's been um, bouncing up and down above and below 80 for the last couple of days. Um, The Dow is at 34,300. It's down about a thousand points um, from where it was about a week or so ago. Silver is up uh, at $23.50. Natural gas is at $2.55. Actually, it should be moving up uh, but uh, we'll have to wait till September, I guess, to see what happens there. Gold is at 1927. Uh, it's been in that range for a while. Uh, you know, I'm hearing rumors that uh, uh, gold's going to be at 10,000, silver's going to be at 50 dollars. You know, uh, all kinds of rumors right now. I suspect that September is going to be kind of a crazy month, um, and so we'll have to take a look at there. Uh, Wednesday. Not a lot going on in terms of reports. Uh, the only big thing then is uh, the oil report that comes out at 10.30 Eastern Standard Time. Uh, the National Gas Report that comes out on Thursday at 10.30 uh, Eastern Standard Time. Uh, Thursday will be the biggest part, biggest activity, a lot of information. Uh, continuous jobless claims, durable goods reports. That'll probably be the busiest day in terms of reports that'll affect uh, trading. So heads up on that one. Um, And uh, unfortunately, I have a rumor that out there, they're talking about implementing uh, COVID restrictions starting in September in colleges and October uh, and other places. So kind of put your ear to the ground on that one, mask up, uh, you know, uh, temperature checks, all that crazy stuff that we did a couple of years ago. It should all be done uh, by December of 2024. Um, My guess is that'll probably uh, be broken up uh, and done by then, but they're saying a new variant's coming out. So, you know, take it for what it's worth. Uh, but uh, uh, be prepared that that might be an issue. And that's what makes trading such a good uh, opportunity for you. No, no matter what kind of trading you do, um, you know, you can do it at home. There's no compl- uh, employees, there's no customers, there's no bosses, and there's no restrictions. Um, so it's kind of a nice place to uh, trade and uh, make a little bit of money and uh, hopefully uh better yourselves through this next crazy event uh, that like I said is probably going to last through 2024 um, and I'm you all know what I mean I think um, so uh, be prepared for that I'm uh, still praying for the uh, victims in Maui I hope that they find more than they think are lost right now and uh, you know, 
our administration is doing a great job in terms of uh, their reaction. I guess you can see my sarcasticness in that one. So good luck and uh, heads up on these reports, make some money, technical trading, um, and uh, like I said, make some money. Talk to you later.